What's going on YouTube? In this in this special video, I'll be talking about bullying. Not in particular one person. I'm just here to call and talk about all bullies and people that get bullied. First of all, I'm gonna talk about people that might be getting bullied as we speak. People that might be getting bullied right now or that have been bullied over the past couple of days, weeks, months, years, whatever. Whether you're in high school, um, middle school, elementary school, maybe even college. Let me just tell you something right now. You can stop it. If you're like a person that's defenseless, you have people that have your back. Don't be afraid to, to you know, speak up for yourself. Don't be afraid to, you know, ask for help. To Don't be afraid to express how you're feeling. If you don't trust somebody, talk to somebody that maybe you do trust. And for the people that, you know, have that strength in them, but they can maybe don't think they have it, or they maybe, they don't think that, you know, they could, they have, they don't have the courage to, you know, show that strength. Let me tell you something right now. You could find that courage. You have the courage to stand up to that bully any kind of way to make them stop bullying you, to put fear into them to know that they don't, um, they, you know, don't want to mess with you. That's what you got to do with bullies these days because a lot of people, let me tell you something. I could be in a bully's head. They bully you depending on whatever situation. Most bullies bully you because of they they are either jealous of you and they want to make you feel bad so they can feel better or they're going to having something going on in their life so the only way to cope with it is to pick on someone else to make them feel as down or even worse than what they do or they're just weak and they're just yeah. at, you know just jerks so y'all just y'all need to Stand up to those bullies because I don't tolerate bullying at all. Any of my friends got bullied. If I've seen bullying. I will not hesitate to stand up and uh, take control of the situation. I've been bullied before, way back in uh, high school. Actually, I'm visually impaired. I'm legally blind. So, you know, I've been bullied at a blind school, actually, because of how I was, how I acted. You know, they love to pick on me because I was, uh, especially my freshman year. My freshman year, I got picked on. Sorry, my thumb keep going in front of the camera. I got picked on my freshman year. Um, you know, because I'm a freshman. And they, you know, say, oh, I'm not this, I'm not that. I don't fit in. I would never fit in. Saying all this crap. Would push me around for no reason. Would try to make fun of me for no reason. All this stuff. And I just one day stood up to this bully. There was a multiple occasions where I stood up to him. There was one time there was just... We was all outside in a group, you know, a group of us outside in the basketball court. And we were there. the bully was right in front of me, like a two feet or a foot in front of me sitting on the bench. Along with a few other people. And he said, bitch, sister skinny ass down. And I said, I said, bitch, don't talk to me like that. I was literally expecting us to get into a physical altercation. But I think it put him in this place enough to where I, when, he, when I said that, I didn't say nothing else. I just turned around and walked away, and he just stood there, and everybody, of course, you know, is exaggerated a little bit. Like, oh, because they weren't expecting me to do that. Another situation, he was pushing me around. Literally, he was pushing me, you know, throwing me against the couch, everything. But it got to a point where I got tired of it because he did this multiple times. One time, a few times, he's made my shin bleed, my leg bleed. And it was one time I got tired of it, so I literally slammed this dude on the couch. And the funny thing is, a lot of bullies, of course, would deny it because they would look bad. Nobody else was really there. It was um just me and him. He would deny it. And the crazy thing, guys, is he was a lot bigger than me too. But that don't. That's another thing, guys. Size don't matter. If the, if the bully is two hundred fifty pounds and you're like one twenty, one thirty, yeah. still stand up to him. Show him, especially that you that small. You don't mess with me. You don't mess. Tell that bully you don't mess with me. Because of course they're gonna think, oh, I'm gonna break this little twig. I'm gonna fuck you up. All this stuff. Of course they're gonna think that. Get it in their head that you don't do. You don't mess with me. Tell them bullies that they don't mess with you. Show them who who really the big dog is. Show them that. Tell them that. Get in their face. 
Don't let them in intimidate you. Don't let bullying get to a point where it gets. Sorry, guys. Somebody was calling. But I was saying, yeah, just don't let people. Don't get it to a point where you want to kill yourself or you want to hurt yourself because somebody made you so feel so bad. I don't tolerate bullying. If I see it, I will confront it. I won't hesitate at all. People know that. I am very protective. I don't give a damn who you are. I will confront you if I, if I find you bullying anybody I care about, even if somebody I don't know. I will I will have that person back. I just, I love to, you know, stop bullying, solve problems for people. I love helping people. And I'm here to tell you guys that y'all can get through it. Y'all can stand up to that bully. I have a little brother over there, seven years old. If he get bullied, I'm, <laughs> by somebody older, I'm whooping their ass. <laughs> yeah, so... Y'all need to stand up. Y'all need to, you know, stand up to your bully. Don't let him, you know, hurt, you know, get in your head. You hear that, shit? Mm -hmm. Anybody bully you, you stand up to that ass. Say, you don't bully, fuck, fuck you, bitch. You want to put you, you, you want to, uh, you don't want the smoke. Just make them get, show that you ain't scared. That's what you got to do is don't show them your fear. Yeah. Oh, someone tried to bully me before and I just beat their ass. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So yeah, don't, don't let people bully you. I keep putting my phone in front of the camera. I'm sorry, guys. But yeah, just yeah. I'm just here to tell y'all, I'm sorry this video is not the best, but my point is, fuck the bullies. Yeah. They don't got nothing else going in their life, going on in their life that's better but than to be bullying people. And I'm handling a bully right now. I did one diss track on him. And he's still acting like an ass, and I don't think he'll ever change. It's, you know, he will never change. But he know now not to mess with me. He blocked me. I got fear into this dude. He never will admit it. I he don't even talk to me because he blocked me, and I'm still trying to contact him. He, he, he's a punk. That's the way. And he wasn't even bullying me. He was bullying people I care about. He tried bullying me with somebody else. That backfired on both of them. <laughs> And I'm currently working on a diss track, again, with someone else along with me. We're doing it together. So stay tuned for that. <laughs> um, but yeah, moral of the story, don't be scared to stand up to your bully. Don't be afraid to ask for help if you are you don't have the courage to, but you can find that courage to stand up to a bully. And don't stop until you, you know, put fear into that bully to where he won't bully or she won't bully you. Well, if you notice that they have fear but won't admit it, because some bullies are very stubborn and or some bullies are very, what is it called? Uh, what is it called? Like, uh, what is it called? Like, they let their, e what is it? Like, get their ego, like their ego be like, they don't like, bullies, that's another thing about them. They don't like to show their pain. They don't, they, you have to go real deep to get them to even show a sign of them showing their pain. I think the diss track I'm doing them. This particular book yeah. <laughs> is real. I kind of feel bad. <laughs> I low key feel bad for the dude out here. Oh, jeez. Right, Jay? Yeah. I feel, I, no key, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> he might cry. He might cry when he's by himself. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> um, that's the only time I feel bad for, that's the only time I feel good to, of making somebody cry was a bully like that. Putting so many people in so much pain. He deserves that at least one time. <laughs> So, yeah, hopefully I can figure this out because I can't, you know, I'm talk I, all I need to do is record the freaking song. I already got the lyrics, but it's all good. Anyways, y'all stay strong. Keep your heads up. Stand up to the bullies. And, uh, yeah, peace.